Hey book lovers, Victoria here and you're watching my books with me. Today I'm bringing you the first in the three regular booktube videos every month, my haul wrap up in TBR. So this video will be my haul and you guys should be proud of me because I bought three books. Three books in November. Technically I've bought more in November, I've bought some Christmas present books, some books for myself that I'm passing on to my mum to give me back for Christmas because she doesn't know what to give me for Christmas. Um, but in other words, I've only bought three books this month. I mean, let's just do it. This is going to be my shortest haul video ever. So the first one is Never Too Far by Abby Glines. This is the second book in the Too Far series and the Rosemary Beach series. Uh, October book haul, I think when it was, you will have seen that I got books one and three in the Rosemary Beach series because Book Depository didn't have this one in stock. The moment I got the email saying it was back in stock, I purchased it. Um, and so the Too Far series follows Rush um, Finlay and Blair Wynn and their relationship and things like that. I don't really know how to describe it without ruining it. And yeah, it's really good. So this was the second book. Then I also picked up at that time, can you guess? Rush Too Far, which is the fourth book in the series. This is actually the first book... Um, this is, this is actually Rush's side of the first book, Fallen Too Far, which was so exciting um, because it was great to see the first one from Blair's perspective and then books two and three were from alternating perspectives. So then to finish off the cycle by going back to the first part of the story and reading this from Rush's perspective was really good. Um, and it's funny because when I finished reading this one, which I'll talk about a little bit more in my wrap up, when I finished reading this one, I just felt the urge to then continue on reading again. It just had that effect, but yeah. Then finally, I picked up a third book from Book Depository and I'll give you a second just to guess the author, at least. Maybe even the book. Um, so if you guessed Twisted Perfection by Abby Glines, or if you guessed Abby Glines, well, you one. This is the four, the fifth book in the Rosemary Beach series and the first book in the Perfection duology and this duology focuses on Woods and Della. Uh, Woods we were introduced to during the Too Far series and Della we were introduced to in the third book Forever Too Far. Um, and their relationship was hinted at, but it didn't really go into too much depth. So it'll be interesting to see their relationship in this book. From what I can gather from the synopsis of this and the second one, it does sound sort of similar to how Rush and Blair's story went with... Um, and them being together, something pulling them apart, and them destined to be together, things like that. Um, but I'm very excited for this one. I am excited and like nervous because I loved the first three books. The first, because I'm excited and nervous because I love the first four books and I love those characters. So I think I'm gonna have a bit of trouble getting into the mindset of two new characters. Hopefully, we'll get to see Rush and Blair in these books though because I love them so much. But I'm excited for this one. The three books that I got in November, I cannot believe I only got three books. It's only just dawned on me now that I'm filming this video. I only got three books in November. This is like the smallest um, and shortest haul video I have ever, ever done. I'm hoping that this means 2017 will be me buying less books because that would be a really, really good thing. So if I do end up in the future having a book haul that has a lot of books in it, can someone please send me the link to this video so I can be reminded of a time when I bought under five books because I think I'm going to need to be reminded of that quite a lot next year. But that is it for my November haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it for what it was. If you've read any of Abby Glines' books, then please let me know your thoughts, especially on these ones and some of her other books if you've read them as well. I highly recommend reading Abby Glines if you want to get into the new adult genre. She's really good and I'll be talking a bit about, more about these books um, in my November wrap up because guess what I read this month? Anyway, I'll see you guys um, very soon with that video. Bye.